Welcome to this OXIS RPA demo. Our purpose is to show you how our robot is able to process a vendor invoice in an Oracle ERP, Accounts Payable module. This robot was configured by the OXIS team, leveraging one of the leading RPA software platforms. Before we start, here is a quick summary of the different steps the robot will be performing. First, the robot will extract the invoice data from the document management system and input into an Excel spreadsheet. This information includes vendor ID, invoice number, invoice date, amount, approver, GL account, among other key fields. The Excel file serves as a control log that keeps track of all the invoices processed by the robot and the status of each invoice. If an error occurs, this log provides visibility to the AP team of which invoices had an error versus which ones were processed successfully. Second, the robot will log in into Oracle using its assigned credentials, user, and password. Third, the robot will grab the invoice data from the Excel log and input into Oracle to create each invoice voucher. Fourth, the robot will register the status of each invoice in the Excel log with a processed or error message depending on the outcome. And last, after all invoices have been processed, send an automatic email attaching the Excel log that includes the status of all invoices so a human can review the ones with errors. Now, let's get started. As the first step in the process, the robot will access the document management system where the invoices have been saved and indexed and will extract the necessary information for each of the four invoices to be processed and include this information in an Excel spreadsheet in four separate rows. In the next step, the robot will read the invoice data from the spreadsheet and use that data to create each invoice voucher in the ERP system. As you can see, there is enough information to create the invoices in the system, such as vendor number, invoice number, invoice date, invoice amount, etc. There is a status column that was added to keep track of the outcome of each transaction with a processed or error message that will be updated by the robot for each record entered into the system. For this demonstration, we are going to use the Excel file named cnregularinvoices.xlsx. Now, we will begin the process and the robot will start entering the invoices in Oracle. To begin, the robot will launch a web browser and go to the VPN portal to establish connection using the credentials provided for this purpose. Next, the robot will log in to Oracle PeopleSoft with the provided username and password. Once in Oracle PeopleSoft, the robot will navigate to the voucher creation screen, simulating mouse actions same as a human user would do. One by one, all four invoices in our sample spreadsheet will be entered in PeopleSoft. The robot performs the data entry by clicking buttons, tabs, and typing values into the required fields. During this process, the robot also performs data type conversions to prevent validation errors based on business rules. At this point, the robot will process the invoices without interruption. Note that the processing speed can be improved if we tell the robot to not show us the step-by-step -step process on the screen. Now the system is telling us that there was an exception in the processing caused by a duplicate invoice number. The robot will pause and log the error before restarting the application to continue with the next record. Since there are no more invoices to enter, the robot will end the process and exit. It is time to open our Excel file and review the status of our four invoices. As we can see, three invoices were processed successfully, and one invoice was not processed due to the duplicate invoice number error. Our robot was configured to send an automatic email including the spreadsheet with the status of each processed invoice, so the invoices with the error status can be reviewed by a human. Instead of an email, the robot can also be configured to save this document in a shared folder or to send the document to a physical printer. Before implementing RPA, this process used to take 5 minutes per invoice, 2 minutes indexing the invoice, and 3 minutes processing the invoice in Oracle. With RPA, the processing time was reduced to 2 minutes and 15 seconds. 
two minutes indexing the invoice. This part of the process is still manual. 15 seconds processing the invoice in Oracle. This means an overall processing time reduction of 55%. In addition to 67% more capacity in terms of invoices processed. This demo is an example of how RPA can generate significant cost reductions and productivity efficiencies in your back office operations, while also reducing human errors and increasing focus of your team on higher value activities.